What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we are starting a brand new series. We are playing Dead Rising 1 upon Steam. It's the original game. I have played it before. It is a ton of fun, and it's a game I've wanted to get on the channel for a few. So I'm not going to waste no time. I went through my settings. I had everything discovered. Playing with my Xbox 360 controller because I'm a god. Just kidding. I'm a fucking liar. <laughs> I'm so hyper right now, man. I'm so hyper. Anyway, let's start up with the brand new game. 72-hour mode. Let's go, dude. September 19th, 1127. Okay. Oh, yeah. We start off in a helicopter. We have to, like, take photos for XP, if I'm correct. something about research for a story that's right got a tip that something big's happening in a nowhere little town like that they sure didn't mention anything about it on tv yeah well i'm freelance pal i don't make my living waiting for the tv to tell me what to cover <laughs> the mouth animations terrify me <laughs> That's exactly what we'll be doing. What was that? The army? Yeah. Looks like taking a helicopter was the way to go. I bet they got all the roads blocked off by now. All right, listen. I want to get shots of the whole town before the National Guard finishes roping it off. Take me over the main street. Also, this is skippable, but I'm not going to skip it. It's a part of the game. I don't remember how to zoom in or anything. Hopefully, this it'll tell me how. Move camera with the right stick. X to shutter. B to zoom in. Okay. Oh. Oh. Man, they're getting some food tonight. I get a better... Jesus Christ! Whoa! What is that? Some kind of riot? <laughs> He's fighting for his life down there, man. Come on, bro! Get him! I have faith in you! No, my man's dead. <laughs> He's dead. Oh, we got a picture of his face. Well, not really. Didn't identify him. Might as well get a few pictures, right? Another one. Oh, we got orange this time. Is this what you came to take pictures of? Oh, it's getting us a little closer. <laughs> His head's like tilted, dude. Oh, dude, I'm really excited to get back into this. Or, get into this in total. It's been so long since I played it. Drama. That's what orange stands for, drama. Oh my! They're munching on my man's over there. They're eating him. What's it look like? All right. Well, we got enough pictures of that one individual guy and his zombie friends. Oh dear! That's a lot of zombie. Doesn't this explode? I don't remember. I swear something explodes. 
I just don't recall what. Oh, that explodes. Yeah, the gas station. I, I remember. I need to get that. Boom! Perfect. Yeah! Just an explosion, you know? Second picture wasn't as good, but it is what it is. Yeah, there's no... Uh, oh, dear. I'm gonna take for a sec. Yikes. Alright, well, let's go up then. Let's do it, guy. Let's go. Oh, yeah, there's a, a lady on top of this building. I'm gonna wait to get good pictures, though. Come on. Need you to wave at me, lady. Come on. I mean, you could easily just duck around them. They're slow and stupid, so... Oh, she's firing at him. Although the zombies appear affected... Not at all. Okay. Got another good drama. We got 405 from that. Oh! Oh, we got that! She's dead, though. Oh! Yeah, she's dead. Why did I take a picture? <laughs> my butt, my finger. It slipped and pressed the button. Dear God. Well, okay then. Hey, can you get me on the rooftop of that mall? You gotta be kidding me. You are nuts. All right, listen. Don't forget to come back for me. As long as you're not dead, Fred. It's Frank. Frank West. Remember that name, because the whole world's going to know it in three days when I get the scoop. All right. Whoa! Oh, it's the military. Get us back down to that rooftop. Frank, you're a crazy son of a bitch. Safe landing. <laughs> And he's out of there. Hello there. Huh? You're the oh. reporter, aren't you? Yeah. No. You came alone. Yeah, I'm freelance. You know, go on the battlefield alone. No crew. So, uh, what's going on around here anyway? You came by helicopter, didn't you? Well, no what shit! Did you see from the sky? Well, if it were just a riot, I doubt the military would quarantine the entire area. The moratorium on information getting out is a little extreme, in my opinion. There's, uh, something else I can't put my finger on. Doesn't sound like civil disobedience. It's too quiet. <laughs> Almost as if... Everyone's already dead. Yeah. 
So why don't you just tell me already? What's going on? I think you'd better see for yourself. This, my friend, is hell. I would edit Highway the Hell as he said that into the video, but I don't want copyright from ACDC. <laughs> yeah, his name is Carlito. We're going to be running into him a bit later. Trust me, I remember a bit about this game. Do I remember every single detail? No. But I remember quite a bit. Frank must be on the heliport at 12 p.m. on the 22nd, or else he will be left behind in the mall. Pay careful attention to the time as you play. So we can check the watch with the left button and return to game. Okay. Does not show much at all. Just shows the time. So. Left. Is it left or right? I don't know. I'm kind of stupid. But it's this button here. Yeah, it is left. Um, the left down button, like the left uh, pad underneath here, is what we use to use the camera. Hello, Carlito. Looks like you're the only journalist that made it out here. I'm looking forward to some nice pictures. <laughs> All right. Well, um, I'll make sure to take some good ones just for you, my guy. Saving. You can save your progress at locations marked with the S symbol, such as the sofa in the security room or the mall's public restrooms. So this is a save point. Yeah, this is a save point. Might as well get my first save point in there. For the series. Uh, game successfully saved. Thank you. Much appreciated game for saving my progress. Have I made any progress yet? Fuck no, but... <laughs> we will eventually. In time. Yeah, I don't think there's anything in here yet. So we might as well just skip ahead. Also, unlike a lot of the other stuff, I want to make this more of a relaxing playthrough. So I'm going to have lots of fun, and also I'm not going to put as much cuts. So enjoy the gameplay. If you want a really cutty playthrough like some of my past ones, I recommend you watch my uh, Kingdom Hearts playlist or my uh, Resident Evil one. Just go to my playlist. The playthroughs will be there. Examine this. Oh. Ooh. What? The zombies are hungry. <laughs> they crave flesh. And she was their victim. Okay. But yeah, this is a, a great game. I played it on Xbox 360 back when I used to live with my dad, like... Uh, ten or so years ago? Not ten years ago, not ten. I think it was about seven eight years ago. I lived with my dad and I played this on his Xbox 360 a lot. You'll know. <laughs> You'll find out, Grandma. That's Carlito's sister, by the way. Hey, this is no time to ogle pretty girls, son. You looking to get yourself eaten alive by zombies? What? Did you just say zombies? Take a look out there. If those ain't zombies, what would you call them? There's been more and more of them since last night. Now, 
They're all that's out there. Hey, look on the bright side. Zombies are stupid and slow. We should be safe in here. All right, then. Feel like making yourself useful? Take a look around the mall. Bring anything we can use for the barricade back here. On delay. Come on, pronto. All right, Mr. Bossy, goddamn. I just got here and you're already going to be on my ass, guy. Now, can I talk to any of you guys? No. No. Now, as far as I know, I don't think we can find Elizabeth in here. I believe that's her name. Her I I don't remember, dude. It's been it's been that long. Um Yeah, there's nobody up here. Well, we gotta go downstairs and we gotta go, um, get some of them stuffs to block the doors. Hello, Lindsay. I'm sure you'll find your dog eventually. Todd, Brian. Hello, Todd. Hello, Brian. Varlene. Donna. Yeah, I hope y'all do well. Mark. Kathy. Alan. You'll be all good. I'm happened to your head? I think you got hit in the head by something, dude. You! Stop right there! Do you have any idea what you've done? Why did you summon me to this place? What are you planning? Would you calm down? I don't even know what you're talking about. <laughs> Y'all men not strong enough to handle one one old lady. She's stupid. Ready to bash some zombies' heads in. Uh give me a two by four. I was gonna read that, but I don't care. Oh fuck, how do you throw things again? Oh! Oh! Oh, I don't remember! Ah! I don't remember how to fucking throw shit! I don't oh fuck, it's been so long. Is it oh it's X, okay. Boom! Boom! Die! Die! All of you can die! Oh my god, there's so many. Oh, you died! I'm so sorry, Mark. Put an F in the chat for my boy, Mark. Ow. I got you, Varlene! Get out of here! Did I just hit her on accident? I did. I am so sorry. No, fuck the people! Ah! <laughs> Okay. I'm out. Boom. Alan's dead. Put an F. Put an F for every Oh, Varlene, I saved you once, man. Come on. Varlene, goddammit. Where are the others? I don't know. I hope they got away. Hmm. Oh. 
as long as those things are in the mall. We'd better not use this door. Uh, what are you doing? The air ducts. They'll get us back into the mall. And apparently those things aren't smart enough to use the ducts. So they won't be a factor. Wait a minute. You want to get back in there? What for? Hey. <sighs> nice camera. Are you a photographer? As a matter of fact, I am. Frank West, photojournalist. Could you show me some pictures, Frank? You really seem to know what you're doing. Who are you guys, anyway? And what are you... I took that one near the entrance. That guy do something? No. Nope. Thanks for showing me, though. Uh, hey, we're not done talking yet. Just who are you guys? I'm Jesse. The man you saw earlier is Brad. That's all I'm authorized to tell you. I'm a simp for Jesse. <laughs> I won't even lie, dude. I will not lie. Jesse's just... She's kind of hot, man. I'm gonna eat this apple. Mm. Oh, that shit's so good. I can't answer your questions. Even if we rounded up everyone responsible and rested them, I've still had my hands full with everything else that's going on around here. Fair enough. Alright, anybody else? I, I don't know. Well, clearly... Um, can I close this? Can't we, like, change our clothes somewhere? I remember there's, like, somewhere... Ah, yeah. Change clothes. Yeah. Oh, shit! Looking swagalicious. That, yeah. I'm never saying that again. I never want to say that again for the rest of my fucking life. Yeah. Mmm, out of these three outfits, I like this one better. Yeah. Yeah, this one's better. Like, way better. There's also some stuff back here, too, if I'm correct. Yeah. Oh, I just switched back to my original fucking outfit. Why? Yeah. Oh, that's neat. I thought it was the original yeah. for a second, but then I, I noticed it was, like, darker. Yeah, yeah I'll use this. Actually, that's kind of cool. Can we use the other ones, or? Yeah. Yeah. It's all white. That's actually kind of sick. Oh, it's glasses. Oh, it's like a little matching outfit. No, fuck it. I'm wearing this. I am running this outfit. Because I look like the sexiest man this world has ever saw. Frank West, don't forget the name. <laughs> Hello, Otis. You ain't planning on going back down into the mall, are you? I wouldn't do that if I were you. But you young folks never listen to me. Well, if you're going to go, well, at least take this transceiver with you. And you better take this map, too. Okay. Obtain a mall map and a transceiver. And we're going also back to the mall. You know, because that's smart. We have the IQ of a genius. As a matter of fact, we're so intelligent, I think we may just be a little smarter than Albert Einstein. Just saying. Just saying. Hey, anybody around? Jeff! Jeff, what are you doing? Hey, Jeff. You good, Jeff? Have you seen my wife, Natalie? She should still be around here. Oh, I remember this. Yeah, we can save the this dude and his wife. Looking for someone? I'll lend a hand. That'd be great, fella. The name's Jeff Meyer, by the way. I'm Frank. I'm a journalist. Oh, sick. 
Escorting survivors. Survivors each behave differently depending on the circumstances and their own varying personalities. It is a good idea to escort as many as possible to the safety of the security room. Call a survivor with the Y button. Right trigger and Y button to set a goal marker. Oh. Okay. So. Over there. Oh, he actually listens. Yeah, I believe Natalie's over here. Mister. Go. Over there. Go see your wife. You got this. Natalie, I brought you a gift. <laughs> oh, we can take a picture of this, by the way. It's super cute. Fantastic. Wonderful. Great picture. All right, you two. You mind cutting your joyous reunion short? It's not safe here, but I know a place. I'll take you to security room. Follow me. All right. Well, we got two. Join bonus. I'm close to leveling up. Over there. Oh god. Uh, get over here to the air ducts. You can do it. <laughs> I'm sorry. You can do it. Okay. Can I climb up? Follow me. <laughs> How do I climb up? Is it? It's not letting me climb up. Um. Fuck. Not what I wanted to do. Oh, there we go, yeah. So, interact is gonna be B. That's fine. Aim photo camera, LT. Aim weapon, RT. Jump A, attack X. Okay, yeah, I, I like that. I like this a lot better. I was about to say, why is it? Why was it not letting me jump? I guess that was just the um, Go. the normal controls for um, how it's set. I I don't know. That was weird though. I need to pay more attention to that. I'm never going to the mall again as long as I live. I've had about enough of this. I mean, I don't blame you for the situation at hand. Escort complete. Twenty thousand PP. Prestige points. Yeah. Prestige points are awarded for actions such as escorting survivors to safety or defeating zombies. When the PP gauge becomes full, Frank levels up. Alright. Attack power increases. Running speed increases. Maximum life increases. Item stock increases. Throw stock increases. Or item throw distance increases. And new skill mastered. So I got a new skill. Which is... Fine. I'm gonna get me uh, coffee creamer. And now we're going back. Now that I have everything figured out, hopefully I don't waste any more time being stupid. So let's go. Not be dumb and let's make some progress with this game. Because I want to play for a bit. Like, I don't want to do a fairly short episode, like 30 minutes to an hour. Or maybe about then, or maybe a little longer. I don't know. Hey, it's Otis, back at the security room. Can you hear me, Frank? Let me give you a rundown on the mall's layout so you know what you were doing. Right on the other side of the Warrior House, you'll find Paradise Plaza. There's a lot of shops there, restaurants, sporting goods, books, you name it. It's a pretty big mall, so you'll probably need to use it. Can use the can now and then. Okay. <sighs> Boom. Oh! Frozen vegetables. I don't want frozen vegetables. That shit ain't yummy. Frank, you there? It's o it's me, Otis the Janitor. Janitor, I can't talk! You said you were a journalist, right? I've been watching... You talk too fast, Otis! Calm down! I guess he must be a photographer, too. Take a pictures at a time like this. You're both crazy. Oh, I know exactly who that is. The Scoop Q provides a list of current requests along with relevant information of survivors. If you were able to fulfill the objects, the scoop queue provides a list of current requests along with relevant information on survivors. If you were able to fulfill the objectives laid out on the scoop queue before time runs out, you can receive prestige points or learn more about the incident. So if it's blue, we have more than six hours. 
if it's yellow, we have less than six hours. If it's red, we have less than three hours. And if it's zero, if it's like colorless pretty much and it doesn't show a bar, there's no time limit, meaning we have a infinite amount of time to do so. By setting a guide arrow, you will be able to more easily navigate your way to a given goal. Guide arrows can be set via the watch screen or the map screen. Okay. Give me that. I want the sledgehammer. The sledgehammer is amazing. I also know where a few other weapons are, too. First, I want to check these boxes. Boxers! Boom! Frozen vegetables! Why are there so many frozen vegetables? We're not even in a freezer, and that's a stun gun. I don't want that. Frozen vegetables! Get that shit out of here. Nobody wants no freaking frozen vegetable. Fuck your frozen vegetables game. Get me out of here. <laughs> Feeling you'd show up. God, it's you. Look, don't sneak up on me. I look ridiculous. Brad was attacked. I located him on the monitor. Oh, it's probably just a sprain. I've got to help Brad. Or he's done for. All right, fine. Give me your gun. Come on. I'm the reason you just got hurt. Let me help. No, I can't let a civilian do that. That's against regulations. Yeah, well, I don't think they had zombie-infested malls in mind when they wrote those regulations, kid. You know how to use this? Kinda. I've covered wars, you know. Covering in wars doesn't mean you participated in them, Frank. Look, after I'm through helping you, you and I are going to have a nice little chat. Oh, is that so? We're going to talk with the, the luscious, amazing Jesse. I look forward to that conversation. The case panels form a guide to solving the mystery behind the incident. When you encounter a key event, a new case panel opens, taking you one step closer to the truth. New development, new case. Uh, you can take a look at the current status of the case panels via the case file option on the pause menu. When all the case panels have been filled in, the truth behind the incident will be revealed. Case 1, September 19th from 12 p.m. Time opened, and then it just shows that. All right, so we got to go help Brad. But before I help Brad, there's a few things I want to do. First, I want to go get me a special weapon that I love. And I can assure you there's a very special weapon that I like a lot. It's up here, though. Oh, we're going to run into a douchebag here, but I'm just going to ignore him. Um, I'm not talking to you. Fuck you. Go fuck yourself. If you've played this game, you know why I'm ignoring him. I, I know that's one of the missions, but... Achievement unlocked. Free fall. You get an achievement from falling a certain distance. Okay. Well, uh, I would kill zombies, but... No, fuck it. I will kill zombies. I'm bored. Die! All of you perish! I'm missing every hit. Just shows you how good I am at video games. Like, I am beyond unstoppable. Oh, owie. Boom. Oh, wait! Um. Due to the fact this isn't a blind playthrough, I can pretty much play this how I want to play this. <laughs> now, in case y'all don't know... Oh, fuck this, man. Get off of me! Why am I not moving? Am I stunned? 
Now, for those of you who've never played this game, if you want this first battle, or this first thing to help Brad to be a lot easier, follow my lead. I know we're a little slow, but we're going to go into this part of the mall here. And we're going to go to the gun store. Luckily, the psychopath shouldn't be there yet. And if you don't know what a psychopath is, a psychopath is a boss battle with someone who's crazy and tries to kill you. Ah, uh, fuck you! Alright, let's get over there. Oh, my thing broke. Owie. What is it, Otis? Frank, looks like you made it to North Plaza. There's a supermarket there along with a gun shop, a cultury shop, or a cutlery shop. Well, we're going to the gun shop. So let's get there. Owie. Well, not Owie. I didn't get hurt, but I don't want to get hurt neither, so... Doo -doo 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 -doo. More chalky milk on the floor. Or coffee creamer. To me, it's chalky milk and it'll forever stay that way. Please tell me the psychopath isn't here yet. I don't recall 100%. I just... Ah! Get off of me! Oh. <laughs> Goodbye. See ya. Adios. Ah! Oh, hey. He's not here yet. Uh, what do we got? Shotgun! Ding dong! Sniper rifle! Amazing. I just... <laughs> I don't want to waste ammo. But yeah, for those of you who are beginning at the game, or just getting into Dead Rising, doing this will make it a lot easier. Sure, it takes a little bit of additional time, but it doesn't take a overkill amount of time. Alright, so now we gotta go get back to Brad. We have a sniper, and we have a shotgun. Shotgun is fantastic for up-close fights, and sniper is fanta fantastic for distance fights. And we're gonna wanna keep our distance from uh, what we're gonna be going through, so... All right, let's go. Do, 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 do. I want to equip the handgun, though. That way I don't lose my handgun. Or I'll drop it before I get into the area we got to go. So we're just going to be walking. Making our way downtown, walking fast. Are we in a town? No. But I can say what the fuck I want to say. Just scrolling through the park. All these beautiful trees, nature. It's beautiful. Ignore all the zombies. Because I don't think that's what nature intended to have around the park here. And <laughs> yeah, we gotta go in there, down there. And then we're going to encounter Brad. Is my aim gonna be on point though? Let's hope so. Sometimes maybe good, sometimes maybe shit. That's how my aim is. Well. Goodbye. See you, Zambi. Or maybe I'll use these bullets on the zombies at the door. Oh, he can't really move. Oh, the handgun is ass! Oh, it's ass! It's garbage! Uh, push left stick to the right and left, or... Get that fucking shit out of my inventory. That's awful. I'm gonna get these guys out of my way. Let's do this. Let's fucking go. Uh, uh, one more. Uh, how do we go again? Oh, okay. Out of my way! <laughs> get out of my way! Oh my god! I will run over all of you! You know, this is normal. If a zombie apocalypse ever happened, just keep in mind, if there's a lawnmower near you, 
You know what to do. Okay. You know how to use that gun? I've never fired at a person. All right, I'll cover you from here. You need to stick to the shadows. Try to get close to the target, okay? And what am I supposed to do when I get close? Well, the best solution would be to shoot the guy. But if you can't do that, keep him busy dodging your bullets and stay out of trouble. Are you up to it? I'm a lot better with a camera. But yeah, I'll give it a shot. Ah! All right. Next time he reloads, that was a funny pun. I'll lay down a suppressing fire. I'm counting on you. Make your way over there. One, two, three. Don't worry, I got a sniper. I don't need to go shit. Um... Oh, dude. Ah! <laughs> Come here, bro! Oh, you son of a bitch. He actually shot me! <laughs> that was Maui. I'm gonna take this. Where is he? Oh, oh! I don't know where he is. Ah, you dick weed, bro. Technically, I, I believe I shot him. What are you doing? Oh, you douche! You ain't shooting me. Wait till I stay still. Boom! Eyes hurt. I can shoot him long range. Owie. Look here, Carlito. I missed. I missed! Oh, it's like a fucking auto machine gun. You're close to dead, buddy. Give up. I'm gonna use my shotgun on him. I haven't used the shotgun. Oh yeah, shotgun time! Otis, now is not the time! It is not the time, Otis! Oh, you dick. Oh, dude. Fuck that! Can I shoot him through the window here? Where is he? Got him! <laughs> Thanks for your help. The name's Brad. I'm Frank West, photojournalist. 
And right now, I'd rather have an explanation than your thanks, Brad. Sorry. I've got nothing to tell you. Look. I don't know what Jesse told you. But as far as I'm concerned, we're through working together. So you cover your zombie story and leave the rest to us. You, uh, you guys are looking for someone here, aren't you? Hmm? Who is that? Where did you, you take You help it? me, I help you. One hell of a journalist, aren't you, Frank? A hot-headed, underhanded, hotshot paparazzi with nothing better to do than to invade people's privacy. I try. You got a point? You win, Frank. Let's work together. Jesse and I are DHS agents. And yes, we are looking for the man in that picture. You're with Homeland Security. Is that guy a terrorist or something? I took that picture in the entrance plaza. Right near the front door. The entrance plaza. You're sure? Hey! So do I have your permission to cover this story? Or not? Ugh. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> I love Brad, man. Brad is great. Alright, we... Oh, we leveled up. An odd old man. Hey, my life went up! I can talk now, Otis! Fuck! I hate to say it, but Otis is annoying. Oop. Oop. Coming, Brad? Okay. I'm not talking to you right now, Otis. Otis is annoying. He annoys the fuck out of me. Boom! Get the fuck out of my way. Jesus Christ. Ah, this hurts my balls. Why am I slowing down? Frank, come on, man. You're better than this. Oh my god! Hey. Okay, I gotta find some health. Oh, uh, get away from me! Uh, health. Yes! Oh, that's so good. So scrumptious. Uh, oh, there's no more. Unfortunate. Oh, there's a pie! I want a pie. Um, actually, I want this over the shotgun. I can just get another shotgun later. The pen! It's funny to beat him with just random ordinary objects, like a fucking pen and everything. It's funny. Oh, Brad's waiting for me, and I'm just wasting his time. Fuck you, you just hit me with a knife? Submachine. Oh, I remember. There's a submachine gun in the um, normal area too. Oh, climb! Jesus Christ! Of course, I stand still like an idiot. All right. The worst thing about the guns is you have to stay still and you have to use the right analog stick just to aim it. You can't use the left one. It's really weird. Somebody barricaded a woman's clothing shop in Alfresca Plaza. All right, thank you, Otis. I know, I gotta wait or else he's gonna bombard me with, Hey, don't rudely hang up on me like that.
an odd old man. And his name is Dr. Barnaby. Sir, if you could just kindly come with us, we can wrap this whole thing up. No, I'm not leaving until you can Absolutely, guarantee sir. me if safe passage just open to this these... gate. Just open this gate no. for your protection. Just I am not press. opening any gate. Thank you very much. I'm going to stay right Do here. Dr. When Barnaby. It's safe. Sir. Thank you and goodbye. Dr. Dr. Barnaby? Goodbye. Well, what happened? You can't just arrest him? He turned down my offer to protect him. Said he isn't going anywhere until I can guarantee a secure route out of here. Jesse has a direct line to HQ. The first thing we need to do is to call for backup. Okay. We're almost the case 1 4 already. Nice. Alright, Otis, what do you want? Right now you're in the entrance plaza. Looks like you, if you get the shutter open, if you want the change in some... Oh. Oh, he said it looks like you got the shutter open. Well, I'm already wearing the most swag clothing. I am nothing less than a sexy motherfucker. Boop. I'm gonna just waste this shit already. Actually, no, let's not. There's something I'm gonna do later anyway that's gonna make me a... God, I hate aiming. I'm just gonna use my other thumb to aim. All of you can die! Okay. <laughs> I need a melee weapon. I don't have one. I'm gonna save the rest of my sniper bullets, though. And I'm gonna look for a decent melee weapon. We can also go find some more clothing. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I don't know. I don't know what other clothing there is to offer. Yeah. Ooh. Fucking fly in the dot. Yeah. Is that like a... I mean, it's just... It's yeah. similar. I think these change the color of our tie. Yeah. No, they don't. I, I don't know what the difference is. I'm kind of blind to that. But okay. Um. Oh, I hear the zombies. They're all over the place. God damn it. I found a woman in the jewelry shop in Alfresca Plaza. She's moving around an awful lot. Lobos looks like she's looking for somebody. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Fitting room. All right. Give me my clothes yeah. back. That looks so stupid. The dumbest thing I've ever seen. God, man. Alright, can I find a good melee weapon to get through all this shit? Can I find something? Wait, I believe there's like a, a weapon shop thing. Somewhere over here. I believe there is anyway. I think it's this one. Is it? No, it's not. I, I swear there was one somewhere in this area where there was, like, samurai swords and everything. Oh, hey, it's the fucking uh, entrance. You know, fucking where Madonna fucked up everything for everybody because of her stupid fucking ugly dog. You know, that fucking shit. Also, sorry, I just have a natural hatred of uh, poodles. They scare me. The most terrifying curly-haired dog breed I've ever seen in my life. You know what? Oh my god. Damn, Frank! You got the moves. I think we might have to wear this. This might be the play. Frank fucking busting some moves in the... In the oh, it's this place. Okay, so it is here. Uh, boop. Oh, I can just... Wait. Can I fucking break it or no? I'm just gonna use this to break everything. Oh, this is already opened? No, it's not. I don't understand. Give me some katanas. 
Alright. I got two katana swords. And I have probably the best outfit ever used in this game. I mean, look at me. Have y'all ever witnessed perfection like this before? No. You have not. Now you have, thanks to me. Make sure to subscribe if you're happy. Because I've, I've done you a favor. I've shown you perfection in the most perfect way possible. And that perfection is Frank West. In some kind of dress-like outfit. Oh, I see all the zombies came back. Even more. I don't want to break my weapons, though. I mean... Okay. Die. Oh, okay. Almost got grabbed by that guy. You're not gonna grow up a woman, are you? Um. Mother's Lament. This one we can do now, actually. I don't know if y'all can hear it, but this freaking mall music. This shit makes me. Oh, come on. Get out of my way. God Christ, man. Hi, Leah. You doing okay? What's the matter? Are you okay? Don't mind me. Just the most beautiful girl here to help you. Grace! Where's Grace? My baby. I want my baby back. Grace! Grace! Answer me. Where's Grace? Lady! Calm down. Grace. Okay, uh, you gotta get up. You got separated from your kid? Grace is my baby. I'll find your baby for you, lady. First, let's get you someplace safe. Just leave me alone. They ate her. Those damn zombies ate my baby right in front of me. Oh, God, I never heard her cry like that. Please, just leave me alone. Well, truth be told, I'd cry if I was getting eaten by zombies, too, so... Wanna stick around with them, with the ones that ate your little girl? Come on, I'm not gonna let you die here. Fair enough. Um. Oh no. Oh, let me pick her up. Okay, we can get out of here. Yeah, luckily, I don't know what it is. But it's like the zombies can't hurt me as much when we're running through crowds when I'm carrying somebody who's weaker. It's nice. Well, out of my way. See you, bitches. Adios! Oh, come on, Grace. Not Grace, Leah. I'm not answering you right now, Otis. I got a woman on my back who gave birth recently. Herb appears to be in pain. <laughs> Wait, it's dark outside. Oh, fuck! Hopefully it's not too late. Hopefully it's not too late. I'm not fighting you guys right now. Sophie, don't die! <laughs> don't die, Sophie! <laughs> oh no, I hate this mission, man. The funny thing is, it doesn't give you a warning for this at all. This is indeed a psychopath battle, though. And also, the best reason I saved my sniper rifle. <laughs> I think I might be able to just walk over to her and bring her with me, though. I don't know where they are. Hey! Lady! Sophie! Come here! Yeah, this way, this way! Come here, come here, come here, come here! Come here! Over here! Come on! Holy fuck! 
Fuck you! Oh! Oh shit! What a bitch! I'm going to die! Oh my god, it's not letting me attack! Leah, no! <laughs> oh, I'm using the fucking sniper rifle, that's why! Fuck you! I can't save you! Fuck! I hate them. I hate them. I also hate the sniper! <laughs> Cause I swear I equipped it, but I was shooting the fucking sniper! Get off of me! Hey, fuck you, get away from me! God damn it, that sucks, that's ass. That's wasted prestige points, man! Wasted points! Oh my god. Hey! Get away from me, I don't like you. But no, that's so fucking dumb. It's so dumb. Now I gotta kill him. I... I gots to kill him. Oh, dude, they're over there. I need more snipers, though. I don't know if the psychopath is over by where the snipers were, but I don't have my katana, so... I'm heading to the gun shop, but I'm killing these guys for fucking up my prestige point opportunities. An opportunity to level up. To get more points. So I can get more stuff. I'm disappointed. But now these guys gotta die. They gots to suffer. They really do. But no, that's sad, man. I fucking... I was so close to saving her. I just didn't pay attention to the time and I completely forgot about that battle being a thing. I also didn't see them show up in front of my fucking face like that because I'm not paying any attention whatsoever to what's in front of me. I might as well waste this fucking bullshit, though. Oh, I hit one. Okay. Ah, fuck you. Any more guns? I'm gonna kill all you. With this fucking pipe. Because I have some bitches to kill. For fucking up people who didn't deserve to die. September 19th. 7 o'clock. Oh dear. He looks angry. He looks angry. <laughs> very angry, very, very angry. I'm dead. I can't get guns. If we're gonna fight these zombies, we need guns. I trust them damn zombies about as far as I can throw them. But I trust people even less. Don't shoot. Look. Let, let's I look so stupid. Talk to my trail gauge. Don't get no closer. I'll blow you all to kingdom come. Hey, hang on. Now, God damn it, I warned you. In a situation like this, I can't afford to trust nobody. Ah, get away! Ah! Jesus Christ! I can't fight him! He's a psychopath I've never beaten. Not only that, I have nothing long range and I have one chalky milk to get me through. And he does heavy damage. So, uh, I'm not fighting this man. 
I am not in a good position at all. I gotta find some more weapons, though, man. I... Oh, fuck you. This is bad. Uh, close the door, close the door, close the door, close the door. Holy shit. Just, this episode is going to shit really fast. I don't want to... Actually, I will take a nail gun. Is that good? Never used a nail gun. It's not good! Ah! Get off of me! I'll shoot you! Get that shit on my inventory. That's garbage. What is this? It's Anna! It's actually really pleasant to find a good melee weapon just casually in a box. Oh my god, though. This is... It's not good, the situation that I'm in. I need more weapons. I believe there's some good weapons in here, though. Although later, there is a... Okay, thank god. I got scared. There is a psychopath battle that I do have to do in here eventually. And him, I know I can beat. The guy in here, I know I can. Just... I'm... Get off me. Fuck, why am I drinking my talkie milk? God damn it. Ah! 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 Die! Oh, come on, man. Ah! Boom! Oh my god, the sledgehammer's garbage! Oh my god, I am in a bad position! Can I have a good weapon? Can I have something at least decent, please? I'm begging you! That was an apple. anything good? Oh, there's a box here. Have something spectacular inside. An apple. It's not spectacular, but it, oh, it will do. It filled my health all the way up. I fell. I pressed the wrong button. Oh, it's a lawnmower. Ah! Oh, <laughs> no! You can use a shopping cart like this. I can't steer it at all, though. Alright, well... I'm just gonna go do the mission I have to do. I can't get a good gun. Oh, dude, this sucks. It's really bad. At least we can enjoy the psychopath's music for now. Please don't just show up and hit me with your car. That wouldn't be very friendly of you. I will hopefully kill him eventually, though. Well, I will. It's something I always do. <laughs> it's every time I've played this game, I will have to kill him. Just right now is not the time. Oh, come on. Get off of me, douchebag. Give me a baguette. Oh. Love me a baguette. Give me a cleaver. Oh, that's right. Can't we, like... Yeah, we can burn it. Oh, use stovetop. I got ex I got prestige points for using a stovetop. Fuck you! Okay. 
Okay, well, bye. See ya. Have a wonderful time. Get away from me, zombies. I have a feeling this tent guy is still following me, though. Which I don't like. I don't like Kent. Give me these. Alright, well, heading back to the safe room. A lot has happened in this episode so far. Well, goodbye. Oh, dude, it's a kid's clothing store. I know what I gotta do. I I, I, I clearly know what I gotta do. Uh, can I dress up here? Where's the kid's clothing that I can wear? That's a hanger. Oh, get away from me, dude. I don't like you. You are not a pacifist. You're shooting at zombies. Oh, dude. <laughs> I look great. Now you've seen something even better than perfection. Anybody watching this, seeing me in this outfit here? Now you've ascended. That's right, you've ascended now. You're welcome. All of you are very welcome. Nobody knows. <laughs> but I believe that's a queen bee. Or something like that. When you pick those up and you slam them down by a zombie. Caption the queen. There is a zombie playing host to a queen parasite. Oh, it's a parasite. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Hello. Uh, give me that. Let's go! Through the vents we go! Hmm. So that's what Dr. Barnaby said, huh? The old coot's not dumb. He wants us to call for help first. We gotta line out or what? <sighs> the signal's being blocked. I can't even contact HQ on the emergency line. So, that looks so stupid. If we want to get our hands on Dr. Barnaby, we're gonna have to secure a way out of here ourselves. All right, we've got to deal with the situation we've been handed. The Boneheads back at HQ might be working on something, too. There's a helicopter coming. Three days from now. At noon. It's my ride. Is your ride reliable? Absolutely. That's how I plan on getting out of here. All right, then. I'll see to it that the DHS picks up the charter fee. Can we take Dr. Barnaby as well? Sure. As long as you tell me what's going on. Okay. I'll tell you what you want to know. Later. We have more pressing business right now. If we have to wait here for three days, we'll need supplies. Uh, water, blankets and the like. We'll get Dr. Barnaby here tomorrow morning. I want you to keep an eye on the monitors. So now, we played the waiting game. But there's still quite a bit we can do, as you can see. But we have this mission here. But I want to find good weapons, and I want to kill some zombies so I can go kill those guys. Also, hey, Jesse. I'm not even going to lie to you, Jesse. 
You're looking fab, my boo. All right. She is just... She's perfect, man. If anyone's gonna simp over a, a video game woman, it better be Jesse. I'm gonna save, though, and end the episode. Because I feel like I've played for quite a bit here. Yes. Alright. Alright, well, thanks for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe if you'd like to buy Dead Rising. Okay. It will be linked in the description below. I look forward to playing this again. It's a really fun fucking game. What? And I'm not even saying that as a joke. So thanks for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. I'll see you all in the okay. next video. Peace.